usually, I mean, for the majority of people who've got to the point where they are looking at a divorce, mm. there is a good reason. Mm. There mm. usually is a very good reason. Um, so it's it's about helping them to, to really understand that. And, to, and, and I remember for myself when I was going through that process, it's a really big deal. And it's and I remember I actually I actually wrote down why I was doing this and there mm. were moments when I had to go back and mm. take that piece of paper out and look at it because there were definitely moments where I thought why why am I doing this, this is so painful why am mm. I doing this mm. but actually I had really good reasons yeah. and not for one moment have I regretted it yeah. it's really interesting because that space of endings and loss mm. is a very very rich emotional terrain to mm. be in so people feel everything under the sun mm. they feel despair they mm. feel grief, but they also can feel enormous excitement mm. um, and hope and mm. looking and, and it's actually it's a space of all possibility because any transition is a space of all possibility. Mm. Uh, so a lot of the work that I do with people is allowing, is helping them to get the gifts of that process. Mm. So the, the thing about romantic relationship, and this is why it feels so raw, is that it's like putting your soul under a microscope. Mm. It's like everything else that we experience in other relationship, when you put it into, when you're in romantic relationship, it becomes ten or a hundred times bigger mm. and that's why it's such an interesting space to learn about yourself mm. what's what's worse having a short short period of time of, of difficulty and challenges or mm. spending the rest of your life utterly miserable